Okay, everyone. I want to do a pretty quick mock review on um this new mock that I just added some pieces to, just to color it correctly. I, I can't find color for these or those. So let's start with the head. Actually, pull it off. It's connected with a normal hand connector from Avestus. This is basically the head. I added these on just to cut kind of hide the sides there. The mouth can open, close, they can turn around. Once like this looks like a bird when they flip these around. I'm not going to do that. I don't really want to right now. And to, if you want to know how to do the head, that's how. That. Put this back on so she has a head. I mean, I changed this from gray to um green. Added these on. Added those. Added this color instead of it being completely black. I added just most of the green pieces. What was that? Weird. I should go lock that door. His arms, uh, pull this off. It's connected by this that's sharpened with a green sharpie, and it fell off. It has these on it that do move, but this will just stay stationary like that. Just to kind of add to it. It has this armor on its shoulder. I'm going to add some more pieces on as I go. It can bend the elbow, it's sharpied because when it's on all fours it needs to be like that so it can support all the weight. It has a really long arm, I'm going to keep adding more on, on onto this. I just added this on. The hand is this big thing, like this, just you know, because I wanted to make a mock that just had this like, huge thing that this was just on there at four, its foot, but it didn't really work out and ended up like this. So now I just have it like that. His arm back on. Now, now, blah, blah, now, and take his leg off. Set him down. And his leg is connected by an old Metro Matoran arm and a hand. It's um, a smaller green one with again the same armor put on. And we'll try to change the black. I had red when I was building him. This is sharpied. I can get it off after a while, but for now. The foot is um one of these uh hockey heads. Like the little piece it can move here. It's basically the knee there and that. So it's basically the leg, not really much. Again I'm going to add on to it, so this isn't really the final form. The back I think a piece might have popped off. Not going around to the back. Yep, okay popped off. There we go. Going to the back. Up on here. And it doesn't stand up because the feet were moved. There we go. The back back has these two. Which was the original idea to have this on his back. Didn't work as as I originally planned but it's still still I could still get at least two on there. Um has these to add on to it and just you know hide hide some. I had these to add color and not have it just be a plain arm. There are is black tubes in there, it's because I had nothing else for it. Then right here, the main piece is basically one of the green um, hockey player bodies. And I'm gonna set them here. I'm gonna get Steve and put him right next to it. So it's about standing on his hind legs. Steve is a, is way shorter, obviously, but Steve is the I got keep saying Steve. Whatever. Um. So yeah, that's Steve compared to him. And down here is um. Get his head. 
his head fell off again. There it is. It's the uh, air car revamp. And it, the air car revamp is taller than him. But that's because his legs are bent when he stands up. So, yeah. He's in the same if he's in a bucket, so it's all messed up. I'm sort of in a little box made of construction paper to review now. So that's that. So instead of having it be a background of that wall, it's now this. And I know I, I can see that over there. Right there, I see that. I'm going to fix that. So I'll see you in the next review.